What do virtual reality games and fresh baked cookies have to do with learning? A lot if you happen to be a student in one of three Westchester classes that are immersed in workings of area businesses to better understand the challenges and opportunities of entrepreneurship. A group of students in John Hess's marketing class are helping the owner of Little Miss Moffat Baked Goods analyze how social media can increase sales at this e-commerce and wholesale cookie business. Another group of students in Tom Elmer's capstone marketing class are doing a business audit for Neverland Virtual Reality a VR experience center. Other student groups are embedded with a motorcycle shop, a bistro, a pressure washing business, and the YMCA, to name just a few. The Cottrell Entrepreneurial Center was the matchmaker that made these partnerships possible, along with the support from the Center for Community Solutions and the Greater Westchester Chamber of Commerce. It's a win-win for both our students and local entrepreneurs when we put our heads together to solve pressing business issues. But don't just take my word for it. Hear what some of the business owners involved in this project have to say. I'm Karen Moffitt, and I'm the owner and founder of Little Miss Moffitt, and I graduated from Westchester about four and a half years ago. I've been really excited. I've partnered with the Cottrell Center, and they've been providing some wonderful resources to help support me and my business. Can you talk a little bit about how you see this benefiting your company? We're a startup and we don't have budget to hire a huge marketing firm. So the ability to tap into this resource was hugely beneficial for us. Now, is this something that you might see as an ongoing relationship? Absolutely. Any business that doesn't take advantage of the brains of the up-and-coming marketing students at Westchester University would be crazy. This is a huge opportunity for any business. So what are your personal thoughts as a young generation? I remember the name of that okay. whatever is popping up. 10 times, and even if you don't have it on the pop-up, even if you had something at the top, you know, under the uh, different menu options, you know, maybe like 10% on. Can you talk a little bit about how the students benefit from a project like this? Yes, well, I believe in this class, it was important that we do marketing. So working with a local business, they're able to help them improve their business as well as improve their skills. And that was the goal of this class. Basically, 40% of my time was spent in lecture. 60% we were doing marketing. We are working with companies to see how we can help them compete more effectively. The unique thing is we're talking about entrepreneurship. And you can't really learn that in the classroom. I thought, what better way than to talk to some of the small businesses we have in the community, leverage the relationship the university has, and get small businesses involved, and that way, the things I teach in the classroom, I then expect them to try to use those when they talk to the client. Well, I'd like to spread the word and let students, faculty, staff, and business community members know that the Cottrell Center is a free resource for them. We can provide them information and support in starting their business or growing their business. Our business benefits by having the university as our neighbor.